Lily Lama Gets Left Out Written by Lisa Kay Illustrated by Bondarchuk Stanislav Narrated by Richard Stibbard It was a beautiful Saturday, so Lily Lama walked to the park to find friends to play with. On her way, she saw Sammy Squirrel, a boy in her class, playing in his yard. Hi, Sammy, what are you playing? Lily asked. Charlie Chipmunk and I are playing hide-and-seek, he said. That sounds fun. Can I play? Lily asked. Sorry, Lily, you're way too big to play with us. Besides, you can't even climb trees, Sammy said. Sammy walked over and told Charlie Chipmunk that Lily wanted to play. They both laughed. Lily was sad that she was being left out, so she kept walking to the park. Not far away, she saw Danny Dog. He looked very sad. What's wrong, Danny? she asked. I wanted to play hide-and-seek with Sammy and Charlie, but they said I was too big. I really wanted to play, but they laughed at me, he said. Lily told Danny that they would go play together at the park. As they arrived at the park, Lily and Danny saw Benny Bobcat. Lily walked up and said, Hi, Benny, what are you all playing? We're having races, Benny replied. That sounds fun. Can Danny and I play? Lily asked. Sorry, Lily, but you're both way too slow for our races, Benny said. Lily and Danny did not like being left out again. They decided they would go play hide-and-seek together. OK, Danny, I'll be it, so you go hide, Lily said. She counted while Danny went to hide. Lily counted to twenty, yelled out, Ready or not, here I come, and started to look for Danny. She walked by a park bench, where she saw Sophie Sloth sitting alone. Hi, Sophie, Lily said. How are you? I'm feeling sad. I was supposed to hang out with Benny today, but then he ran into his other bobcat friends and they started racing. They told me I couldn't play because I was too slow, she said. Danny and I know how it feels to be left out, Lily said. We're playing hide-and-seek. Why don't you help me find Danny, and then you can have a turn to hide? Oh, that would be great, Lily. Thank you. I love to play hide-and-seek, Sophie said with a smile. Danny, we found you, Lily said after Sophie spotted him hiding behind a bush. Hi, Sophie, Danny said. Are you going to play with us? Yes, Lily asked me to play. I'm a little slow moving, so I hope that's OK, Sophie said. Anyone can play, replied Danny. Lily, Danny and Sophie took turns playing hide-and-seek. What do you guys want to play now, Lily asked. Benny and I were going to play soccer. I brought my soccer ball. Want to play? Sophie asked. Hey, guys, what are you doing? Benny Bobcat asked while walking toward the group. We're getting ready to play soccer, Lily replied. Oh, OK, Benny said, looking sad. What's wrong, Benny? Sophie asked. My friends all left to play a game together, and they didn't invite me, Benny said. I'm sorry to hear that, Danny said. Would you like to play with us? Sophie asked. Really? Even after I was mean to you? Benny asked Sophie. Everyone makes mistakes, Benny, she said. The four friends started to play soccer, and before they knew it, all sorts of new kids had asked to join. Of course, everyone was welcome to play. It didn't matter at all if they were fast, slow, big or small. 